Everything Top 10 is proud to present the Top 10 Things You Didn't Know About Josh Allen. Number 10. As you may know, Allen played his college football for the Wyoming Cowboys, where he led the team to back-to-back -to -back bowl appearances. Allen's dream wasn't to play for the Cowboys, however. He had hoped to sign to his local university, Fresno State. He attended Fresno State games regularly as a kid and teenager and played in football camps hosted by the team. Although he was a good high school quarterback, Fresno State never came calling. Unfortunately, in Allen's one and only college game against Fresno State, the Cowboys lost 13-7, with backup Nick Smith playing instead of the future Bills quarterback. Number 9. The Buffalo Bills drafted Allen number 7 overall in the 2018 NFL Draft. Allen was considered one of the top prospects in that year's draft class, and some draft experts believe the Cleveland Browns would take him number one overall. Perhaps the reason Allen dropped to number seven was due to critics continually banging on about his low completion percentage for the Wyoming Cowboys. By the time Allen was drafted seventh overall, he was the third quarterback taken after Baker Mayfield and Sam Darnold. Number 8. Allen is in a long-term relationship with girlfriend Brittany Williams. Since Allen's rise as a top quarterback in the NFL, Williams has gained a lot of fame. The two went to high school together at Fireball High School, just outside of Fresno, California. While Allen played for the University of Wyoming, Williams was a cheerleader at Fresno State University. The couple had a long-distance relationship during college, but since being drafted, the duo has been inseparable. Williams has grown a large following on social media thanks to Allen. She often posts pictures of the pair traveling and spending time together at home. Number 7. Perhaps one reason Allen wasn't recruited out of high school by a D1 school was due to his desire to play baseball and basketball in the offseason. On the baseball diamond, Allen was a pitcher and could throw a 90 mile per hour fastball. He was also the basketball team's leading scorer. At the time, Allen was 6 feet 3 inches tall and weighed 180 pounds. By the time Allen was finished at Reedley Junior College and prepared for life at an FBS university, he was 6 feet 5 inches tall and 238 pounds. Number 6. Prior to Allen signing to the Wyoming Cowboys, he still held out hope of joining Fresno State. The Bulldogs weren't interested in Allen, however, as they signed quarterback Chasen Virgil. Allen was unhappy with Virgil being recruited over him as the quarterback from Texas was 6 feet 1 inch tall and weighed 170 pounds. Feeling aggrieved by being overlooked, Allen sent an email to Fresno State's coaching staff. His email simply read, 61170? A Fresno State assistant coach replied, yeah, we got our guy. Good luck. Virgil would later transfer to Southeast Louisiana University. Number 5. Allen grew up in the California farming community of Fireball, a small town of around 7,500 people. Allen's father, Joel, and Uncle Todd own a 2,000-acre farm that grows Pima cotton, cantaloupe, and wheat. If Allen hadn't ended up at a D1 college and drafted by the Bills, there is a good chance he may have gone on to become a farmer. His father and uncle are third-generation farmers. Number 4. Los Angeles Rams cornerback Jalen Ramsey made headlines in 2018 when he called Allen trash. He also labeled the quarterback as a stupid draft pick. In September of 2020, with Allen continuing to showcase his talent as an NFL quarterback, Ramsey did a U-turn on his previous comments. Ramsey stated Allen is talented and presents a challenge for the Rams' defense. Allen had the last laugh when the Bills and Rams played. Buffalo won 35-32. Allen threw for 311 yards and four touchdowns. Number 3. Allen may be a success in the NFL, but the road to the Buffalo Bills was long and winding. The quarterback went to Reedley Junior College after high school. One of the assistant coaches at Reedley was even married to Allen's cousin, which may have helped him get a spot on the team. He played just one season at the school, and with his departure looming, 
sent out email after email to Division I schools, hoping one of them would recruit him. Allen sent out around 1,000 emails to D1 head coaches, offensive coordinators, defensive coordinators, and anyone else that would potentially have influence on player recruitment. Number 2. The quarterback's mass email campaign worked in the end, but only two colleges reached out to Allen. Wyoming and Eastern Michigan were the two schools to contact Allen and offer him scholarships. Eastern Michigan ended up withdrawing their offer to Allen when the quarterback visited Wyoming. Allen went on to throw a total of 44 touchdowns and for 5,066 passing yards in 27 career games for the Cowboys. Number 1. Allen is not the only athlete in the family. In fact, his parents created a sports-themed household that inspired not only Josh, but his sister, Makina, and brother, Jason. The large ranch that the kids grew up on enabled them to play sports and run around all day long. According to an interview conducted by Mom LaVon, the family ranch had a basketball court, sand beach volleyball court, a batting cage, and a putting green. No wonder the Allen kids have become top athletes. Now, with Allen in the NFL, his brother Jason is a baseball player at Saddleback Community College and has aspirations of playing in Major League Baseball. Sister Makina is still in high school and is a three-sport star. She attends Fireball High School, where she plays softball, basketball, and volleyball. That's all, folks. Please leave a like if you enjoyed the video and comment down below which NFL player you want to see us make a video about next. Make sure you subscribe to us as well. Also, tell us who you think has the stronger throwing arm, Josh Allen or Patrick Mahomes. See you next time.